Coming from the venerable lineage of the original Warhammer, the Warhammer 2C takes those concepts and adds a little bit of that clan spice to the mix. The clans have made a few modifications to the Warhammer versus its inner sphere counterpart. If we directly compare the base Warhammer weapons loadout versus a stock Warhammer 2C, you'll quickly find out that the 2C will most likely mop the floor with its cousin. As it rightly should, too. Considering it's built on an endo steel frame and has close to double the armor to boot. This particular miniature is of the Warhammer 2C 4 variant. This is a second line battle mech that has two clan ERP PCs, a Mark III ER small laser, and a pair of ATM 6 launchers. In Alpha Strike, the 2C 4 variant is Death Incarnate. Now that's my opinion, but, but just look at it. If you aren't playing variable damage, this monster will auto-delete smaller mechs in a single volley. It does 7 damage at short range, 6 damage at medium, and 4 at long. And that will certainly make quick work of most lower tonnage foes. And for those of equal tonnage, it's sure as hell going to give them a bloody lip in a one-on-one -on -one fist fight. In classic Battletech, hit them at long range with the ER PPCs, and, and as you close the gap, smash them with the ATMs. Just make sure you watch your damage to your arms. While they do hold your PPCs, there's also case-protected ammunition storage for your ATMs. You certainly don't want to rely on the head-mounted ER small laser in a firefight. As far as the miniature goes, I like the new art of the 2C that's in the Project Phoenix TRO. It's hard to describe, but its squat pose and profile really do hit close to the map of the original design. The miniature, however, decided that it wasn't going to slouch or squat. It's a super tall miniature for Battletech that was fairly easy to put together. You just really had to put the pin, put pins in the arms to the torso, and that was it. I painted my 2C in a Clan's Hell's Horses scheme. Unfortunately, I don't have any Hell's Horses decals to apply. But I did leave space on the miniature in the future if the opportunity arises. A solid mini from Ironwind Metals, and a very useful battle mech for either version of Battletech that you play. This is a very recommended pickup if you play in the post-clan invasion time periods. If you play a major clan or inner sphere faction, chances are you can rock the Warhammer 2C4. If you'd like to know more about the Warhammer 2C, check out Record Sheets 3085 Unabridged Project Phoenix and Technical Readout Project Phoenix. Hey, thanks for watching. If you want to help the channel grow, just share the video with a friend or a Facebook group or something like that. Hit the like button or subscribe. Smaller channels like mine thrive on word of mouth. So letting a friend know, it's a big help. Thanks.